Snooker, it's back in the house, back in the house. I wasn't going to do any um, vl vlogging today or this week actually. I've got quite a lot of stuff to do. Welcome to this vlog called You Couldn't Make It Up. Ta da! You know, I've just turned the TV off now. It's, uh, some of you may remember a program called Jack and Ori Tell a Story and make everybody believe you. Yeah, so anyway, I'm just gonna go down the pub to test my taste buds. You know, just so I'm safe to drink again. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do, because you're allowed to. I'm allowed to exercise that right to do that. What a load of cods, isn't it? Total cods. One rule for one, one rule for every person else. Did you see how many swore then? <sighs> Sounds getting me though. Just, oh yeah, you I mean, I'm so, I'm so glad I've got plenty of other stuff to do. If I was watching the news all day, I'd be pulling my hair out. Even sneaky wife's going mental. And don't talk about sneaky girl. Oh god. Yeah. Don't follow your own rules, eh? No. Catch you in a bit. Anyway, guys, <clears throat> on a lighter note, um, going to back to tea tree to school in two weeks i think it is the ninth with my first teaching school because i've been teaching online for the past god knows how long it's been a little bit of a struggle but hey we got there in the end anyway yeah. super duper anyway yeah after watching jack and i i thought some of you may want to um listen to a really old joke okay so anyway <clears throat> the joke goes as follows plasterer goes to the building site and he's doing his job and all the other plasterers and bricklayers are saying hey mate we're all wife's having an affair right now with this bloke and they kept on and on and on at him until so he just couldn't do it anymore he just snapped got in his car drove to the block of flax where he lived ran up the stairs smashed the door down and he got in, his wife was in her nightgown and he's gone, okay, where is he? Where is he? I'm going to kill him. <clears throat> and the wife goes, I don't know what you're talking about. I do not know what you're talking about. You've been really stupid. When all of a sudden, he heard a car start. So he went out onto the veranda, or balcony as we call them here. See this car start moving. He goes back into the kitchen, picks up his fridge, whoosh, drops it on the car. Bang. So, all of a sudden, his wife picks up this big frying pan, knocks him on the other it, knocks him out. Next thing he knows, he's in hospital. And there's these two guys next to him. Uh, one's got a broken arm and a broken leg, looks a bit bad. And he looks over to the other side, got two broken arms, two broken legs, bandaged around the head. So he looks at the first guy, and he's got one broken arm and one broken leg. Yeah, what happened to you, mate? You look rough. He goes, I was pulling away from my girlfriend's block of flats, and some bloke put a fridge on top of me. Car. Oh, just chucked it over from the tower block, straight on my car, knocked me stone cold out. Went blimey. Ooh. Don't know me about that sort of thing, do you? No. So he's going to be worried now, the bloke, isn't he? There he looks at the other bloke, got two broken arms, two broken legs. Bandage round the head. He said to her, oh, 
You look well rough, mate. What happened to you? He went, if I told you, you wouldn't believe me. He went, no, no, I'll, I'll listen to you. Yeah. Well, I was sitting in this fridge. Ta-da! And that's Jackanory for adults. Okay. Anyway, I'll do a proper vlog in a week. See you later, guys.